There's a Japanese proverb saying, Kacho fugetsu, which the direct translation is flower, bird, wind, and moon. And it means experiencing the beauties of nature to learn something about yourself from it. The northernmost island in Japan of Hokkaido is also known as Yukiguni or snow country. We get the cold northwesterly winds from Siberia, which picks up the moisture from the Sea of Japan. It's consistently windy and stormy, and basically, we get dumped on here. My name is Matthias Takahiro Hosogai. I'm half Japanese and half Swedish, and I have been working as a guide at Hokkaido Backcountry Club for the last seven seasons. What keeps me coming back to Hokkaido is the quality of the snow. We chase the feeling of not being able to hit the bottom, and Hokkaido's the best place to do that. So skiing has always been a pretty big sport, especially in the 70s and 80s during Japan's economic boom era. And all these different ski areas popped up all around the country. So it was a big part in Japan. A lot of the Japanese locals would try and perfect their ski technique, which is a very Japanese thing, a lifelong journey to devoting yourself to one skill. There is a Western misconception that the reason a lot of Japanese people won't ski the backcountry is that there are spirits in the trees and it's a no-go zone. I think it's more to do with the rules that have been put in place by the ski resorts. The mountain wasn't designed for you to ski on, but the pistes were. A lot of people feel they're not good enough to ski in the backcountry, and you're seen as a bit of a rule breaker if you do so. The winters here in Hokkaido are very harsh. It's consistently windy and stormy. We can get anything between sort of 15 and 20 meters a season. A lot of the days when we get a big snowfall, the community will come together and clear the snow. You know, you'll see people in their 70s and 80s bring out their tools and clearing snow together. It's a very social event. An onsen is a natural hot spring all over Japan, as most of Japan is volcanic. And there are hatches along the side of walkways which you can lift up, and there's a stream of onsen running through. Drop the snow into these hatches, and it'll melt the snow. A lot of our storms bring in 30 to 40 centimeters of really light density snow. I find that just the amount of snow that we get in Hokkaido, not even skiing it, just the amount of snow, brings out the most joy that anyone can have. There's a Japanese saying, Shinrin yoku. The direct translation would be forest bathing, and it's supposed to heal your mind just being around in the nature. And I think although Japan has a very agnostic population, that has carried on to the present time.
For me personally, skiing through the light, fluffy snow, all the problems in my life go away, and that's what I really love about skiing in Hokkaido.